Hey folks, Steve here. How you doing? Hey, if you would, like and subscribe. Even though you don't know what the video is yet, why don't you go ahead and like it? Why not, right? <laughs> hey, uh, I'm sorry. I'm having a good day. Uh, just covering up this thing. Let me tell you about it. My bench is weathered in, but I just don't like if I don't have to let it set out and be exposed to the elements that it isn't just for the longevity of the bench until I find a source of lightweight plywood and I think I have found a source of lightweight plywood. <laughs> Regular sheet of AC plywood, you know, just whatever I'm buying, I couldn't tell you, you know, well, it's, you know, Baltic, I have no idea. It's veneer core, it's, again, I have no idea. Not a plywood guy, I just use the stuff. I'll say that an average sheet of AC plywood, three quarter inch is 67 pounds. They can go a little higher. I haven't seen them very much lower than that, 67 pounds. So with that being said, I have found 55 pound plywood is what the advertiser is saying. And I have an Amish guy that is a master cabinet builder who has an access to the largest plywood supplier on the East Coast. If anybody could get lightweight plywood, it should be the largest supplier on the East Coast. They say they have 55 pound. So I'm going to look into that and see what their uh, half inch also weighs and then buy some sheets. And if it really comes up to being 55 pounds, and I'll weigh the stuff. I'm building that again, and I'm going to make it the actual compact bench. I'm going to buy Ron Polk's new plans for the 2.0 or 3.0 or whatever it is with the hanging stuff and all that and the cart and the, mobili the mobility and all. I'm very excited. Yeah. Right now I'm going to cover it up. Because, man, if this got wet, uh, well, actually, yeah, if it gets wet, it doesn't soak in water because it's I've, I've really sealed it up. But still, if this got wet, <laughs> three man left. cover even though it's a little bit leaky with that piece of pla with that piece of plastic because I did have a tarp on it and the tarp leaked like a sieve so uh, and that might have been before I had this this up I had standing water for th at least three days I had standing water in the pockets on the inside that was you know a good solid inch so hey a plus to the fact that it was sealed because I held the water didn't let it go and it didn't soak in I didn't have any swelling but I don't want to be doing that so pop up I'm gonna protect a lot of it and that plastic better than the tarp Yay. Have a good one. 